What's up, guys? It's Crazy here. Today, I'm bringing you guys a, a, a quick gameplay. Uh, I forget what map it's on. Um, possibly, I'm thinking Ascend. I'm not sure, though. I'm just trying to adjust my mic because I'm not doing this where I normally do commentaries. So, uh, I'm trying to make sure you guys are going to be able to hear me okay, which you should be able to. Um, but, yeah. Um, so, today, I kind of wanted to talk about something that's been bugging me a little bit because it always comes up around this time of the year. Uh, it's around this time in March, uh, and it's pro-life versus pro-abortion, and, um, and you guys may think I'm kind of impartial because I'm Catholic, so I'm obviously going to say I'm pro-life, which I am, but uh, I have a bunch of reasons to support my decision on being that, and um, I'm not calling anybody who's pro-choice. I'm not saying that that they're wrong. I'm just saying why I'm pro-life. And um, a lot of people don't understand that. Like, basically, in the, in my church, we believe that abortion is murder. Um, that life starts at the moment of conception, and that's how I believe. It's how I was raised, and it's how I'll continue to believe. Um, one second. Anyway, sorry about that. My dad came in my room. Um, so, it's how I'll continue to believe. And it's because, like, like I said, life starts at the moment of conception. And um, it's basically... And so if you guys look up some of the methods of, of abortion, it's just disgusting. Um, there's one method where they grab the, the fetus with a hook and, like, vacuum it out. It's very violent. And... Um, there's, I'm pretty sure there's one where they basically decapitate the fetus if it's born alive, uh, so it's basically executed. Um, there, there's a bunch of disgusting methods, and, like, and there's a bunch of stories about how messed up people are after they get them, well, why, why would you support something like that? Why would you support the killing of innocent peop, uh, innocent people? And, um, I don't support the death penalty either. Um, as much as I think some people deserve to die, uh, I will never, I still don't, and I will never agree with the death penalty. Um, and that's also, like, um, they should just have to suffer in prison, and I know that's not what taxpayers are gonna say, but, um, I know a bunch of people that, I know a bunch of adults that are taxpayers that don't really, that would rather see the death penalty go, um, cause, I mean, the death, if, if the death penalty, you're giving somebody who gave somebody else a brutal death, so you're murdering somebody who murdered somebody else to to t show them that murdering is wrong. God, I I don't know if you guys are gonna understand what I'm saying, but uh, and that's just death penalty is wrong too. Um, and another way you're doing it is like you're giving them a peaceful death when they gave somebody a wrong death. For example, like um, you give a murderer like. Ted Bundy, for example, I don't know if he got sentenced to the death penalty or not. I, I don't really know. I just know how brutal he was. And Ted Brody, Bundy or Jeffrey Dahmer, and if if either of them had gotten the death penalty, they would have gotten lethal injection. Unless they I, actually Ted Bundy got the electric chair. Now that I think about it, but I'm but I know he chose that. Um, and I know there's videos of his execution. If you guys want to see it, uh, I'm not. I'm not gonna link it or anything. I'm just saying, if you guys are interested in that, uh, you can see he's, he starts bleeding out of his nose, and I've seen the video. It's disgusting. Um, there's two people in this world that I will agree deserved to die, and that's Osama bin Laden and Saddam Hussein, and that's because of what they did. They they were both Iraqi leaders. They were both in sole control and just terrorizing people's lives. So, yeah, they, they are two people who I will make an exception to that rule for. Um, and you guys are probably, I'm probably going to get a ton of comments saying, oh, it's because you're a Catholic, you don't support all this stuff. Well, that, I, me being a Catholic has nothing to do with it. I've done my research. I know 
so many facts about abortion. I know so many facts about the death penalty. And um, you guys could quiz me on the, on the death penalty. And I could probably answer a lot of questions. And by the way, guys, this is Biolab. I just got the gameplay to pop up. Um, like, the death... I mean, you guys could say that I'm kind of supporting the death penalty and stuff. Some people, like... I got a DM one time, and they, they said, you, uh, like I was tweeting about how I'm against the death penalty, and someone said that if I'm against the death penalty, then why do I play Call of Duty? Well, I'm not against war. I never said I was against war. I am really interested in wars, actually. I, I've, I'm, re I'm a really big history buff. My, my whole family is, and... Um, <clears throat> Like, I'm not against war, I'm against capital punishment and abortion, because both of, both of those are just murder. Um, it just doesn't make any sense to me why capital punishment is okay. Like I said, you're murdering someone who killed somebody else to prove that murder is wrong. That it, Where's the logic in that? Um, and... I've been one to say that I'm not afraid to express my opinions, and I'm just gonna stay, stand by that. And uh, I always, even if I get called out for someone not agreeing with my opinion, I'm gonna stand by what I said. And so you can go ahead and comment what you want if you don't agree with me. I mean, if you don't agree with me, that's fine. But I'm just saying, like, if go ahead and comment. If but if you like, if you respectfully say, I di I strongly disagree with you because you. For example, because of this, this, and this. Fine. That, you, that's your opinion. But if you're going to call me out, call me all these names because of what I just said, um, I'm just going to delete your comment probably and ignore you. Like, that's not your way to get your point across. Just if you have an opinion that contradicts mine, say, uh, say it nice and uh, say it respectfully in the comments below as if you were talking to a teacher or something. So, that's going to do it for this video, guys. Comment, like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, be asking for below. As always, guys, this has been Sick Crazy. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.